Hey guys, let's talk about the long liver profile. In the past video, we started discussing the long liver profile. We started with the first stage of a liver profile. So in this video, I'm going to move on to the second stage, or also known as the middle or maturity stage. Now, in this second stage of a liver, there are various features. Uh, the main features in this section are bluffs and the waterfalls and rapids. I will see the characteristics of, uh, of the features of the middle cause of a river valley. Uh, the speed of the river is fairly low. So in this stage, the speed of the river becomes low compared to the uh, the primary stage. Uh, the second line that most of the work of the river is the transportation, uh, whereby various materials uh, that were loaded in the first stage are uh, being transported in this middle stage. The third one that the cross section of a valley in this uh, section is an open V. The fourth one that the slope of a relief is gentle uh, since that uh, the river flows in a normal speed. Now the volume of a river increases. So in this stage, the volume of a river becomes larger than compared to the primary stage. Uh, the other characteristics that the lateral erosion predominates. Uh, the lateral erosion, this is the erosion that occurs at the sides of the cause of a river. You see the features associated with the middle cause of a river valley. We've said that there are bluffs, uh, waterfalls, and the rapids. Now, bluffs, these are the steep slopes of the uh, truncated spurs in the middle cause, whereby interlocking spurs turn into bluffs. Now, bluffs, these resulted from the interlocking spurs. Uh, so in this stage are uh, from B, these bluffs as from the beginning, whereby they were like interlocking spurs. The other feature, we said that there are waterfalls and rapids. Uh, waterfalls and rapids can also be found in the middle stage of a river valley, whereby this is mainly caused by the river rejuvenation, which increases el elusive activity and, and transportation. Hence, it leads to the development of the waterfalls. Let's see the old or the lower stage. Now, this is the third stage of a river. The many features of the lower section of the river valley are flood plain, uh, bladed river, oxbow lake, uh, river, and the deferred tribu 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 tributary and the delta. Now, characteristics are as follows. The first one that it is the river mouth. So, in this stage, uh, it occurs to be the river mouth. The second one is that always there are granted gradient falls or slope falls. The third one that the main, main work of the river is deposition. So mainly deposition occurs in this, the old or lower stage. The fourth one is that the cross-section of a valley is a U-shaped valley. Uh, the other characteristic is that the speed of the river is decreased. So here is where the river decreases, decreases its speed gradually. Uh, the other characteristic is that the river valley is very wide compared to the other two stages. Let's see the importance of erosion and deposition features to human beings. Uh, here we'll see the importance of various features that we've seen in the various uh, stages of the river profile. Uh, Ruiz form vet, very fertile, fertile soil in the desert land. As we've seen that Ruiz is one of the features found in the erosion and the deposition of the river profile. Uh, waterfalls attract tourism. As we've seen that it, Waterfall are formed in the primary and the middle stage. So waterfall attracts tourism who bring uh, an income to the country. Uh, the third one that is the headlands in the coastal areas are natural ports. Uh, these natural ports can be as a, a place where buyers, ships and the carriages can uh, take in and out. The fourth one that the coastal features form leading places for fish whereby we get uh, fish more and that improves the fishing industry and the other importance that the coral reefs are used as the building materials and the for settlement so these are just of the few of the importance of the erosion and the deposit depositional features to the human beings so that's all thank you for listening